Hey guys, what's up? Mass Blonde here, and we're back with Nancy True in Shadow at the Water's Edge. Okay, so I did some playing outside of the last gameplay, and I have a ton of pachinko balls, so I have enough to get everything in this vending machine, but the main thing we need to get is this little book here. So, we're going to go ahead and just grab everything. This is adorable. I want this. Love it. So cute. Like that. Yes. yes. I think that's the same thing, so I'm not going to get that. I need that. Okay. And we still have plenty left. Okay. So, let's see. Give you a few minutes to read all that. Recording a site of a haunting might actually be a really good idea. I should look into that. Yes, you should. In fact, we should probably make some phone calls. Let's see, anything over here? Oh, we already did all that. Okay, let's get over here. And we're going to save because that's what we do. And where do we want to go? Let's go back to where is it here I'm gonna go back to the Rio con so it's nice and quiet now let's make some phone calls um, should we go in order I definitely want to call Savannah speaking. Is this Nancy? Yes. Great! I'm so glad you called. Why? So you can hang up on me again? Oh, that. Don't take that personally. I'm an assistant. My job mostly consists of hanging up on people. That and remembering birthdays. I met your friend Bess, and this is probably awkward, but I know we haven't gotten off to the best start. But I'm really not a bad guy, and she's really cute. And maybe you could help a dude out? All right. What? Well, she said she's going to be hanging around the expo, and maybe you could, like, tell me about what she likes, or maybe give me some idea of what I might say to fill the awkward pauses. You may have noticed, but for the last while I've been with Savannah, most of my conversations have been about ten seconds long, and they usually end up with me hanging up on someone, and I don't think that's going to cut it. Oh, I see. Do you think you could help? Well, I was talking to her, and she really wants a copy of Savannah's book. Oh, I see what you did there. Okay. As a gesture of goodwill, I'll do it. And Nancy, I'm sorry I hung up on you. That's okay. <laughs> and Nancy, I might have to do it again. But should that happen, it's just business. Bye, Logan. <laughs> wow. Okay. Do I want to call any of the others? Call Bess, George. Let's get up to the room and then we'll call. Anything up here for me? Hello. Yeah, I'm totally not going to ask her that. I'll talk that to would you later. Be rude. Okay, see ya. And I am not going to do that. All right, so we're going back up to the room. There we go. Oh my gosh, that looks super comfortable. <gasps> Someone's been in here. It looks like whoever left those footprints walked right through the wall. You mean the partition that you can open? It's not really walking through the wall. Actually, that also looks like they walked that way too, so... Nancy, you do realize that this opens, right? Sweetheart. Anything in here? No. Oh my gosh, more of that super comfortable bedding. Yeah, I'm gonna guess this is some sort of like puzzle or something, but that clearly opens into the other room, so I'm gonna guess it's an inside job, and I'm so going to guess that, um, yeah. Which I kind of suspected anyway, but now I know for sure it's an inside job. That looks so comfortable. Okay. 
Let's see if there's anything out here. No, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, I would totally stay at a place like this. Probably only for a night or two because I'm not fond of the communal bathrooms. And I need my Wi-Fi. Just saying. Okay, no new assignments. Alright, so I guess we should go ahead and have her go to bed. Ugh, I was trying to get in front of the bed, but who cares. Alright, so menu, clock, I think it has to be 7. Okay. How did it get so late already? I should get to bed. She spent all freaking day at that school. Do some sightseeing, girl. See, look, the whole day is gone. I'm in Japan. I'm going to see some freaking Japan. I don't want to spend all day in a classroom. Gosh. Please. Let me see. Ah, oh, here we go. Let's New see assignments. how they did. They... Uh, no. So you get a frowny face. And... Deck is quiet. My cat likes to hunt though. Hey, eats her. No. Bad. My cat likes to hunt in the barn. The horse eats hay. A lamb is a baby sheep. Oh my gosh. Gold star. You are teacher's pet. Likes to hunt in the hay. The duck eats barn. No. No. This is all wrong. That goes quack. My cat likes to hunt in the barn. The horse eats hay. A sheep is a baby lamb. No, you were so close though. You were so close. All right. They did try. I will give them credit for trying. Okay. So yeah. Let's. What do I need to do? Um, I got more puzzles, but I really don't feel like doing that right now. Let me call my buddies and see what's going on. Whoop. Alright, so, phone. Let's call Bess. Hi! Uh, there were watery footprints in my room that led straight into a wall. Why are you still there? You've lost your mind. You know how in the scary movies you always want to yell, Don't go in that door! But they never can hear you? Yeah? Well, you can hear me, so don't go in that door! Call this mystery a wash and come stay at our hotel, which has a nice ghost-free view and a ghost-free pool and tiny overpriced ghost-free packets of peanuts. That's a nice offer, but... I think I'm getting close to figuring out what's going on here. Since you won't listen to reason, you're going to have to listen to George on this one. Thanks a lot, Bess. Unfortunately, I don't have a clue about what to do with this one. But Nancy, whatever's going on out there, be careful. I will. Promise. Okay, Yumi sent me... Okay, Yumi okay. sent me a great picture of you two. Oh, isn't that cool? I love the poor Cora booth here. I'll show you where a really great one is if you get done with your mystery before we have to head back home. I'm working on it. I promise I'll see you guys soon. Okay, so wait, wait, hold on. I'm not getting very far with Miwako. What do you mean? She never seems to answer my questions directly. That's never a good sign. I'd keep an eye on her. She could just be quiet. Or she could be hiding something. I would say she's hiding something. I had another strange run-in with a ghost here. What happened this time? I was in the hallway, and one by one, the door started to slam. And I heard the sound of water dripping. Creepy. Just thinking about that, I'm not going to be able to sleep tonight. Not sure how you do it. It is a little creepy, I'll admit that. I just need to figure out how someone could do it. Good call. It could be pretty easily automated, I think. Uh-huh. I'm saying it's an inside job. 
Have you seen the ro yeah, we'll ask about that. Have you seen the robotic cats they have here? I love those! I don't know if they're cute or creepy, but I love them anyway. Miwako has one. It's cute, but it's a little aggressive. It's in guard mode. There's a way to override that, some sort of code word. Right. I need to figure out what it is. Hmm. I bet if I check around the expo, I can find someone who knows. I bet you that could. would be amazing. Thanks. Anytime. Need anything else? I should go. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay, we've done enough for today. So we're going to go ahead and save. Yeah, so saving it. And uh, next time when we come back, what should we do? Oh, I know what I want to do. I'm going to try to do some more of those puzzles, maybe. And then when we come back, I'm going to try to talk to Miwako and Rintaro and Yumi again. Hopefully by then they'll have, I think I'm supposed to get like a package or something. I remember sending off that envelope, but I don't know. Anyway, um, thanks for watching guys. And if you like this video, please hit that like button and um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.